Three, two, one, go. I'm in the uh, Audi RS e-tron GT. You know, the one that I spanked you in last time. Let me tell you about my car, okay? It's properly powerful. 761 horsepower, 1,050 newton meters, not to 62 in 2.9 seconds. It's rapid, but I don't think it's quite as rapid as that thing, the Tesla Model S Plaid track package. Apparently, 1,020 brake horsepower and naught to 62 in two seconds. Three, two, one, go. Oh my God. Oh, oh, bro, he's got ahead of me. Oh, I'm actually winning. I'm actually winning. I am not winning. Oh my word, that Tesla. Come on, Audi. That Tesla is gone. Audi's behind me. Oh, that car is so fast. Look at it. Oh, I haven't got a chance. <laughs> Jesus, but I've beaten the Audi. That is nuts. Ah. The Model S Plaid track package managed a quarter mile time of 9.6 seconds at 144 miles an hour. The Taycan Turbo S managed a 10.8 and the RS e-tron GT got 11.2. Since there wasn't any real point in the Tesla embarrassing us again, we moved on to the next round. A rolling race from 50 miles an hour to see how that would play out. Three, two, one, go. Oh my God. <laughs> it's gone. Oh, blimmin' nor a Tesla. The Tesla's gone. I'm almost neck and neck with the Audi. The Audi's hanging in there, actually. I'm quite surprised by that. Come on, Audi. We can do it. We can do it. We can't do it. Nathan, boss man, is on another planet in another league. Wow. Nathan, great. What will win in a drag race between a Bugatti Chiron Supersport, can't believe I'm saying this, and a Tesla Model S Plaid Track Pack? Three, two, one. We're going sideways. Woo! Whoa, just hold it in there, man. Oh, I've got him! Come on! The Tesla's a head run coming now! Come on, Bugatti! Oh my god, I'm... Oh no, he's coming. Oh! Oh, come on! Whoa! That was nuts! So then, what exactly happened? Well, both cars completed the standing quarter mile in 9.6 seconds. However, the slow motion action replay reveals that the Bugatti finished just ahead of the Tesla. Now we have a rolling race from 50 miles an hour. The cars, that's just in its usual setting. I'm in Bugatti mode and automatic mode for the gearbox. So just like I'm cruising along and then there's someone in a Tesla model that has flat. And we think, I oh, know, we're gonna have a race. And I go, three, two, one, go. Blimey, this took ages to kick down. God, I have killed him. But now we're on, that's ahead of me. He's gonna come quick. God, look how quick he's coming. Can I catch him to the quarter mile? No, he's gonna have it in the quarter, but now I can pass him. Watch me gap him now. Oh, wow. This is gonna be insane. We're here at Paul Ricard, the F1 track in the south of France. We've got 11 of our Model S plaids. They're coming here with the new track pack. We're putting them through their paces out on the circuit today. Model S Plaid is a beast on the track because we intentionally designed it that way. With 1020 horsepower coming out of the powertrain, incredible acceleration. With track pack and its upgraded brakes, wheels, and tires, all the performance limits are lifted and balanced. 
With the Model S track package, we completely transformed the car with a brand new track focused tire paired with a forged aluminum 20 inch wheel in addition to our carbon ceramic brake package. Most high performance brakes use chopped fibers. Ours use continuous fibers in a 3D matrix. The other innovation here is the ceramic friction layer covering the entire surface and creating this mirror finish. The friction consistency means you get predictable braking performance whether you're driving to the grocery store or on a racetrack. The Model S track back blade really represents the vision of Tesla of achieving a vehicle behavior and response that is always very, very true to the driver inputs. What this means is that even the most demanding driver, the most sensitive, will take this car to the limit and it will still have the highest confidence in it.